Please make it a day. Right. Make it a day. World's first a day. Bloody Mary slam. Ah, yes, yes. So that was different. <laughs> a little less spicy. Charging through it. Oh, he's, oh my God. he's doing it. Run for it. Did you want another one? Damn. The crazy part is he's flying the plane. <laughs> the co pilot. <laughs> I'm just doing navigation. It's all good. Wait, what? I'm flying? We haven't even been to Vegas. See you guys. That was a double two. Wait till that kicks. Where are we off to next, kids? Mexico. No. No, not Mexico. Let's go. We're going to Cabo and taking Skinny's wife. Yes. <laughs> you guys go ahead. Bodyguard. We'll leave you both at home. <laughs> you guys go ahead. Are you recovering from your Bloody Mary a, right a, now? I'm not a fan of Mexico. I've never been there. It up. Really? <laughs> it's, it's, I would go for like two days. Yeah. I can go for a week. No. I'm taking you for a week. Oh, heads up, guys. Oh, oh sorry, dude. 100%. We go on the boat sometimes and I have a nervous breakdown. Hey, me on a boat all day? How do I handle that? Catamaran? No, thank you. No, in the Cologne on a boat. How do I handle that? Who's pushing the button? Who's on this side? Somebody hit a button. There's only one option. Who hit the button? I didn't touch it. I didn't touch it. With my mind. We gotta go. Where's your passport? I left on the bar. You left your passport on the bar and I'm the one slamming Bloody Marys? He's like, Well, I was filming, I got distracted. Yeah, why would I have to? One mimosa. One <laughs> Am I getting red yet? Yep. The problem is, Dave didn't have enough to do it. I had it on the bar. Oh, that's us. Later, bro. That's us. Abram, Friar King. I've been a daughter. Abram, Friar King. Have you ever heard that expression? Abram, Friar King. Abram, Friar King. Have you ever heard that expression? I'm going to jump on a flight. You don't jump on flights, you walk. However, this would require you to jump, for sure. If you couldn't make that gap onto the, onto the plane, <laughs> You would uh, you would have to jump, or you wouldn't make your plane. What's going on? Well, you can't find his passport. He asked for it if she had it, and she's like, I don't have your passport. And we're just talking. She's like, Oh shit, I've, I've definitely got his passport. <laughs> He's panicking up there. He's like, oh, you do have his passport. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't realize I had his passport. <laughs> oh, hold on. Let's see that passport photo. Oh, I can't show that. Just showed all his info. Look at that. I'll have to cut that out. Wait. Starbucks right That's there. That's your man. That is. Woo! He's gotten better with age. <laughs> Give me that. He's not happy with me right now. Does he know you? Did, did you say you have it? Yeah, he's not. Oh, he shouldn't have said anything. The guy, poor guy was sweating. Dave doesn't get mad. No, he gets even. Nah. Uh, he will. <laughs> he will. You guys, stay over there. No, stay there. We're gonna, we're gonna scare Dave. Don't look at me. God, you can't look at me. I scared Dave with this password. Oh. Get your passport. Is that a joke? I was I was freaking out up there. there was, they're there all was all the employees looking for the bathrooms. Hey, thanks for the heart attack. <laughs> I didn't mean to. I really didn't. I, I thought when you called me, we were doing it on purpose, and I was like, "That's not a nice prank." I think I just always used to being organized. I was like, "That doesn't look like me. I have hair." You know how that much more hair than I do on your head. <laughs> so we're gonna give you guys an inside look. What's like to travel with DDE? Featuring a better half. Hi. Also, welcome aboard. Let's see. Oh, that's good. Always. That's good. Uh, she hired me to make a little pants. She's famous. I did. Hey, hey do you are. have it in carrot cake? The there carrot is? cake? Actually? Oh my gosh, your day has been made. Can you feel bad for me? Honey, are you getting in? Because I'm going to sit right here and you're holding everybody up. Oh, sorry. Poor man. Oh my god. Please not go all the water. Anything else that you need me to do for you? Uh, you hold my passport for me? <laughs> do you want me to No. No? No. Are you sure? I'll say this in my pocket. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. One more passport. So she called me when I was up there 
Did, did you feel that? She called me, she's like, I have a passport. I got so mad because I thought she did it on purpose. I thought she grabbed it to play a prank. I'm like, this is not funny. Your flight board's in 10 minutes. I was like, for fuck's sakes, and I hung up on her. We're still what do you call this? Stevie? I call it friends with benefits because I'm on your benefits and I have dental now. There is. It's just right here. So we fly, I'll get in trouble for this. This is a Canadian rule. We fly probably eight to 10 flights a month, every month for years now, so we're quite accustomed to it. Um, there's certain nuances involved with it. There's certain faux pas to avoid, which we'll explore today. In the meantime, we got Team DDE on the third row here on Air Canada flight AC99, service to Vancouver. Departure time is 1.40. We'll be sailing at about 35,000 feet, arrival Vancouver, Two hours, 45 minutes, pin on tailwind. Pretty sure that's not allowed on there. Huh? They allowed us on there? So we're in business, which is something that Damon and I discussed after COVID, that I'm gonna go back to the US and all the travel, we're gonna spend the extra money this time. We never used to do this, this is a new thing, but we thought we worked really hard, we're in a place down where we're the business can afford it. And it's not, a, this is not a long flight, so it's not crazy money, it's a few hundred dollars more per seat, which I mean, again, does add up, but something we discussed that we would do. And one of the benefits obviously is some leg room on the seat side, but also you get fed. This is the Air Canada menu, which I will show you now. So we have an appetizer, we have heritage mixed salad, julienne apples, pomegranate seeds. And then for the main course, you have two options. You've got the chicken, tangine, pearl pasta, green beans, and olives. And then, or the vegetarian thing, which looks disgusting. Oh my god. Tangine. Tangine. What? It's not tan, not tangine. This is Tangine. Isn't it Tangine? That's Tasha. I'm going to use it right now. Tasha. <laughs> is it Tangine or is it Tangine? Tangine. Is it? Yeah. Or just pronouncing it correctly. So are you saying that you're wrong? I think it's because you're going to fly So there's your options and then... <laughs> Obviously, it's all France. So in Canada, you have to have English and French by law. And then you've got beverages, spirits, beers, and non-alcoholic options. We'll skip that. We'll stick to our alcoholic beverages here. Nothing really, nothing crazy. Nothing crazy. It's decent options. The service is usually 50-50. Sometimes you get an amazing uh, air steward um, or stewardess, flight attendant. And sometimes you get really bad ones. I remember when we had status with Delta, they would bring you a cup of coffee and a mug before you took off or an alcoholic beverage in the afternoon. They don't do that in Air Canada, you're on your own. Um, and the service experience really depends on who's serving you. There's a very huge, vast difference between someone who likes you and someone that hates you. Can you do a headphones? Yes. No problem. Please get a mask. I'll be nice. And then you get headphones because you have your own monitor right here. You watch your own movie. Unfortunately, they don't have DDE on here, which is weird. I know. <laughs> so then, what's gonna happen is we're gonna take off. Then shortly after, we come by with a beverage cart, offer you wine or a drink. We'll take your meal order. What's crazy about how it works is based on your level of status, you get served first as far as what option you want. Because a lot of times they'll be out of one of the two options. So Damon and I are both super elite 100K, the highest level of uh, status with this airline. We only fly Air Canada. Not really by choice, but by that's the only option we have for the route we take. Um, so they'll come to us first, ask what we want, which is kind of cool. And then you get part of luggage and things like that. There's lots of benefits, but like for this experience in the airplane, that's the only difference is you're going to ask what you want first before anybody else. They don't, like, you can't come over here and party. Like, they're going to give you one drink and basically say that's it. You can ask for another one, but they don't keep on serving you. I know Delta and United, they just keep pouring your drink until you can't walk. Air Canada's. I would say classier, but the word only is boring. People are operating your seatbelt fast and out. They need to retrieve all baggage, flashlight, drunk devices, such as laptop computers, must be safe to stow. Or flight drunk devices should be sent to airplane mode. U.S. TSA regulations prohibit passengers from assembling in any area of the cabin, including their own lavatory and galley areas. Thank you. Yeah, I'll do the chicken, please. Thank you. Miss Avery, I'll be
in the Canadian wilderness. Psych, we're just in the airport. Yes. Back in Vancouver. All right, guys, that's it. This is goodbye. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. He's Bye, Damon. <laughs> oh my God. Goodbye. See you next I'll week. See, I'll see you at home. Yeah. See you. Have a good day. Goodbye. Oh my God. Bye. Bye. See you next week. Damn it. I just feast. Feast. Hands my penis. Oh my God. So that's connections because they went to Kelowna. And you and I have an appointment with a ferry, a big boat, because we have the girls all week. And oh my God. Mrs. DDE and I have the final leg of our travels today. Beautiful day here in uh, Vancouver. Getting on our last flight. This is a short one. Hey, you wanna say hi? Hi. Welcome to their Canada crew. They are super friendly, our friends here. back home and look who's here look can I now? say hi say hi to everybody it's Mia she's showing Presley's doctor what what is that it's a filter on snapchat it makes you bald and it gives you a mustache <laughs> that's Presley with a mustache and with no hair with no hair yeah how are the pooches they're really good. Oh, we're trying. Oh, these are so good. We're addicted yes. to these. Look, yes. look at the dogs. Yes. Oh, they're so tiny. Not as good. It's like roll, a nerd roll. roll, but in like a gummy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What are these again? We had gummy clusters. They're like clusters, yeah. Mrs. Skinny got us. They're good. Addicted to them. I like these. Not the sweets are free, Dad. Jeez. <laughs> 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 then, Dad can donut goldfish. <laughs> Not the feet for free. Not the feet for free. <laughs> a foot only badge account. <laughs> That's a thing. These are cool. Ghost candy. That's one in my candy stash. Dunkin' Donut pumpkin. We bring back all the stuff you can't get in Canada. That's goldfish Dunkin' Donuts edition. I found, spice. I found those marshmallow things. Yeah. Um, in, in, um, a store here. <laughs> Which ones? <laughs> yeah. Hi, <Yeah>. world. <laughs> what? <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> that was funny. Okay. Well, we're home. We made it home safe. You want to make a video know. with me tomorrow? Doing what? But, yeah, I mean, yeah, sure. But what are we doing? I'm going once. Going Can't give it away for free. Oh, Gotta right. wait till the next <laughs> not, episode. Not for free. <laughs> No feet for free. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What's our travels today? It, what's, is this for stories? Yeah. I think behind the scenes. Like what happens when I'm not all. Not all there? What's up, guys? <laughs> Welcome back to Daily Germany Talks. And the truth is, <laughs> I'm actually yelling when I say it. Yeah, I'm like. You have to, to express the energy through camera. You gotta talk to camera. <laughs> It's very loud in person. Just like that. Do it again. Woohoo! <laughs> yeah, it's really loud in person. We're like yelling. No you gotta go to bed. One more, one more. Yeah, yeah. Hey, we just got home. Have some candy and then go to bed. One more. <laughs> no. Yeah. No. Uh, Roma. Hey, she's gonna pee in there. She's gonna chew on dirty underwear. Roma. <laughs> yeah. yeah, that's the yeah. thing. I don't wear underwear. Come in here. Okay. Look what... okay, it's late. Almost. 
11.30, just got back. And uh, the developer part, not why I did this, but I know why. There's outdoor spots out front here, and there's a spot in the garage, and they have their sprinter van parked in my spot, their, their construction van, just to fuck with me. So I'm parking now in front of their other building to fuck with them. Keep it classy. Look at that, garbage cans arrived. That's exciting stuff. Time to unpack all this shit. Oh, I love you guys. What do you got in the bag, baby? Hmm? What'd you pack? Well, there's like some groceries that I brought from the house that... Remember these? Do you, do you feel that bad for me? Oh. <laughs> oh, and then look what Lonnie got the girls. Aw, Lonnie is a neighbor of ours in Kelowna. Lonnie and Craig. Mm -hmm. Not her parents. You think it's her parents? It's actually not her parents. Like we can burn us and burn all the... Put all the good energy. In. The good energy? Let's talk about bad energy for a second. Here's how cheap these cock-sucking developers are. There's a light for the dining room. They never bothered to install a light at oh, all. Okay. Sorry, I'll, I'll give you a gift. No. No. What is it? What? Well, I thought we could pop this and put it in the fridge. Did you buy that for me or did yeah. you have that inventory? No, I bought this for you. Did you? Yes. Give you a receipt? No. Is it a re-gift? What's the job? How much you make? <laughs> Where are you from? So you just, just before I get distracted, they put this plug in here instead of a light to save 80 bucks? Yeah, 80 bucks. Just put a fucking light. There's no light in the dining room. Like what? So I bought some Ikea. So I'm going to do a little wiring myself. Good Ikea hacks. And then... We do that really Ikea wire it yourself? Yeah, it's not hard. Call me Sparky. Yeah, well, it's going to switch off and then tap and get to make sure they don't spark. I haven't taken any life insurance out on you So, in the last video a few months ago, months ago, holy shit, how last was the line? A few weeks ago, I we went to Ikea. We had not been here since the Ikea trip, so tonight and tomorrow, we're going to do all the Ikea stuff. And by we, I mean... I don't know if you or something. How have you done it already? What? She's already done things. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, let's move your, your donated cereal. What in the fuck is that? Stop. Don't be rude. I'm not being rude. See the vision. Oh, orcas. I got you specific things. Orcas for the ocean and your background is Scottish. That's very thoughtful of you, actually. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I see a pineapple over there. I actually had that from years ago. You know you put a pineapple in front, somebody, in front of somebody's door when you want them to leave, but they've overstayed their welcome. Really? Yeah, okay. Someone told me that the pineapple's a sign for swingers. And the story is the ones were like... If you put it in your front door, I think. I you just know. said the exact same thing. But no, put you put it, it in your bedroom, outside your bedroom door. It's time to leave as a guest. When he's asking them to leave, isn't that more polite? It's like a sign, but maybe this is a swinger situation. We got a bench. We have a light. Big things are happening here. We've got blankets. We've got a mustard pepper dog. <laughs> oh, poor Crosby. Yep. What are these for? To make it super romantic. What are we got whiskey for? Pardon? All right, boys, whiskey. <laughs> Put some hair in that chest. There's something called a whiskey. Fuck. And it begins. I moved in. <laughs> what in the fuck? Hey. Is it a humidifier? No, it's a diffuser. Like a back of a Ferrari, a Lamborghini, Pista, carbon fiber? Same thing. Oh shit, look at that. Yeah. Uh, usually it looks different than that. Mm -hmm. That's why I was confused. Mm -hmm. Morning. Good morning. We're here at Home Depot. We sure are. We're getting some things. And it's gonna be one of those days. You took longer here than you did at IKEA. Did we really? No. I think it was, it was you though. Yeah, I wanna get some cool lighting and some fancy electrical switches for dimmers and with an app. You trying to get me? <laughs> How much damage did we do here? That's almost the exact same as that, oh the IKEA trip. Here we go. Oh, yeah.
All right, so we are fully in domesticated life. We have a school pickup at 2.20. We'll we'll groceries. groceries, Walmart. We gotta, we can't forget the car seat. We have to take the car seat. I've done that before. I've done my daughter's daycare when she was in daycare. She's in kindergarten now, by the way. And I get there and I don't have a car seat. So I left it at the house. So I'm like, hey, I'll be right back. Is there more than this? Is this all we got for $1,000? We got and everything. Don't forget the plant. <laughs> I was saying to the court, if I was single, my place would not look anything like this. It would be barren and desolate and depressing the way I, dad always wanted it to be for me. Oh my God, why do you call it so dark? I always do. What's all the dirt for? Seriously, what's the dirt for? We're making, we have plants. I love how you're laughing at me and not helping. <laughs> I don't know how she did it, but she's going to Walmart. This place gives me the worst anxiety. It's the lighting. Oh, well, it's horrible. What you bought? At Walmart. How is that even possible? Why wouldn't we? Um, can we have, can, can it's date night. Can we have daddy? <laughs> I'm with the back seat with Kelly. Can we have daddy's song on? You want daddy's song? Yeah. You want some corn from the 90s? Yeah, I want the window, like, like the window song. CJ's oh. turning in the opposite direction he needs to go in. I want that one. No. Oh, the sunroof song? Can we have that song? Okay, well, I've had a long day. I haven't filmed most of it. been super busy. I've got lights installed. The closet yeah. lady came by, and uh, we're making some serious progress. But Kelly got picked up from school today, and we're doing a date night. CJ, I'm the Uber. CJ is the Uber <laughs> in the front, and the ch -ch 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 wagon, and I'm with Kelly in the back. Kelly's with her date. And they're doing construction right now next to us, <laughs> and they're not wearing respirators and cutting concrete. Enjoy that. So, where are we going for dinner? What do you want for dinner, honey? Um, Grilled cheese? Mm -hmm. What if they don't have that? What if all they have is raw fish? Raw fish? I don't like it. You never had sushi before? No. You don't want sushi? But we have chicken nuggets. What if it was raw chicken nuggets? Yeah, but I want it. Do you want them cooked or raw? I don't know. What do you cook it? I'm just joking. <laughs> We're gonna go to, uh, you wanna do a cactus cup or probably cactus has more room? She just swing at me? Yeah. She took a swing at me to get her attention. Daddy, Yeah, honey, we'll figure it out. We're gonna go to Cactus Cup, okay? Yeah, but Are you gonna get a Shirley Temple? Yeah, but can you cook like I like? I won't be cooking anything. I'll be requesting from the chef to make you something bespoke. Something that I like. Something that you love that involves raw fish. Yeah, I'll stop recording now so we can play music. Copyright laws. <laughs> Composer needs to make some kids' music and we'll be, we'll be covered. No, it's not just kids' music. Right, Kenley? What? What's your favorite song, Kenley? How's uh, it go? I like. Uh, I can't remember. And I want to go home? I want to go home. Yeah, but I want that. I want. I want. I want to like Kelly. How about it's about that time? In a minute, I'm Anita. Yeah, Oh, um, I don't know. I want grilled cheese. She wants a grilled cheese sandwich. I'm not sure if that's an option. How about calamari? No. No. Um, you want quesadilla? I like quesadilla. Chicken fingers? The quesadilla is basically the grilled cheese sandwich. You know that, right? 